federal government grazing site have no place in the constitution, says lawyers. Senior advocates of Nigeria have started talking about the grazing reserve site by the president for the nation. President Mahmoud Buhari recently reconstituted a committee to review 368 grazing sites across 25 states in the country to determine their level of encroachment. This came despite the fact that all the southern states, including Benin and a few others, are opposed to open grazing but prefer private ranching. Also reacting to the development, Benin state government threatened to sue the federal government over the development. Law and human rights in this nation have been asked to comment and they have started talking. Still one of them, Senior Advocate of Nigeria, Ochuku, states should challenge federal government's grazing site committee in court. Professor Ernest Ojuku, Senior Advocate of Nigeria, said, I think we should see the committee's report. Hopefully, the report will present the basis of any recommendation they will make. It will be easy to test the validity of the committee and the efficacy of the recommendation in our judicial system. On the face of a constitutional delimination between federal and state powers over land, agriculture, ETC, and the Land Use Act, it may be difficult for the federal government to resurrect past grazing route regulations. My advice is that state government should set up their committee to advise them so that they will also be in stronger legal position to challenge the federal government and its grazing size committee. Another senior advocate, Mr. Norrison, resurrected grazing sites and open challenge to state. The senior advocate said, of my own, in his own view, the Land Use Act has vested land in the territory of each state in the governor of the state. As such, we cannot talk about the extent or level of encroachment on grazing routes by the state. The only land the per resident has control over is the FCT, being the federal capital and the seat of government. Constituting a committee to review 368 grazing sites across 25 states is to put the government of the Federation on collision course with the state. The resurrection of grazing routes by the president is an open challenge to the state that have been outlawed, that have outlawed open grazing because of the implication of the grazing route as an endorsement of open grazing. The decision of the governor of Benue State to seek judicial intervention is in order. Another senior advocate, Oluda Ramola, on his part said, this is a clear indication that Buari is not a listening president. Apart from the anonymous decision of the governors in the southern state to ban open grazing, many states in the north have decided to embrace ranching by insisting on creating grazing routes. Buari is sweeping against the tide of public opinion. Unfortunately for the president, the law is, the law is not on his side. The governor of each state is in control of the land in the state and not the president or the federal government by virtue of the Land Use Act. The Land Use Act is an integral part of the Constitution. Therefore, any grazing route, gazette giving the federal government the power to maintain grazing routes in any state without the approval of the state is ultra vice, null and void. That is the comment of a senior advocate of Nigeria, Oluda Ramola. What is more, there are several Supreme Court decisions confirming the power of each state to grant a planning approval within the territory jurisdiction. Many states have already made law banning open grazing. So why is the federal government insisting on having this open grazing site within the state? As the law stands today, Buari cannot only have his way of maintaining grazing routes across the country by staging a coup against the constitution. This is not visible for an elected president who swore to an oath of allegiance to the constitution my people, what is your take on this? Should the federal government continue with this plan of open grazing or should they list it to the voice of reason? Please make your comment know. Thank you.